On the southwest portion of Guimaras Island in the Philippines is the IMS, or the Igang Marine Station of the Southeast Asian Fisheries Development Center Aquaculture Department. IMS lies in a protective cove dotted by several islets, an ideal site for marine cages. The station is composed of four islets and clusters of floating fish cages interconnected by foot bridges. The station maintains hundreds of broodstock of various commercially important species that provide eggs for research and production runs. The station was established in 1974, primarily for studies on the breeding of tiger shrimp in pebs. Here, the life cycle of tiger shrimp was completed in captivity in 1975 and of milkfish in 1983. These are the first breakthroughs of Seafdeck Aquaculture Department. Over the years, the station has expanded its research activities and facilities. Technologies have been developed to spawn high-value species such as grouper, sea bass, snapper, and pompano. Hatchery technologies have likewise been developed for the fry production of these species to cater to the needs of fish farmers. IMS also has stocks of pompano and abalone for studies to improve their culture in sea cages. Almost 200 giant clams may also be found beneath the water surrounding the station. These were released by SeaFdeck for stock enhancement. To support research and training activities, the station has an office, staff quarters, and a laboratory. A fully furnished guest house is also available for visitors and tourists who come regularly to see the large fish broodstock and snorkel in the placid waters of the coast. IMS is host to Americulture Park, which serves to demonstrate Seaf Deck technologies in a commercial scale. Entrepreneurs who are interested to invest in aquaculture are also accommodated in the fully equipped Mariculture Park. To ensure that the station's activities do not pollute the environment, studies on the area's carrying capacity have been performed and water quality monitoring is done regularly. IMS provides technical assistance and hosts training for fish farmers, technicians, government personnel, and students. Livelihood projects have likewise been successful for fisherfolk from nearby communities. The vastness of the sea likely holds the future for increased fish production, but environmental protection, stock management, and conservation remain as priority concerns. As it strives to strike the balance, the Igang Marine Station of Seafdeck Aquaculture Department envisions itself as a model facility for responsible and sustainable tropical mariculture.